Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. It is a new release week for Blu-ray and 4K Ultra HD, so here's what's coming out online and in stores for October 10th, 2023. Don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate link in the comments section below if you're interested in any of these titles. This week, Paramount will be releasing Transformers The Rise of the Beasts, which is getting both a Blu-ray and a standard 4K. Both of these will be readily available in stores and online. There is also going to be a non-exclusive 4K Steelbook Edition, which has been confirmed to be in stores. Disney will be releasing Snow White, their very first animated film, on 4K. It will be getting a standard slipcover edition and a Best Buy exclusive Steelbook. This Tuesday, the classic horror film Rosemary's Baby is making its way to 4K. Better late than never, as Universal is releasing a 4K of Megan this Tuesday. In addition, Best Buy will have an exclusive steelbook only available at that retailer. Available exclusively at Best Buy, Universal has the Halloween trilogy beginning with Halloween 2018, Halloween Kills, and Halloween Ends. This has been confirmed to be in store at Best Buy Tuesday. From Shout Factory Screen Factory comes the 4K edition of Pumpkinhead, which is getting a standard slip as well as a Best Buy exclusive steelbook. This Tuesday, Paramount will be releasing a non-exclusive steelbook of Friday the 13th on 4K. Out on Blu-ray this Tuesday, Strays, starring Will Ferrell, will be making its way to brick-and-mortar locations. The horror film The Boogeyman is also going to be in stores this week. Available exclusively at Walmart locations this week, steelbooks of Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey, and Jeepers Creepers Reborn will be at that location. Lionsgate has a 2023 action thriller King of Killers on blue, and Ben Kingsley stars in the 2023 sci-fi drama Jules. MVD will be releasing both a Blu-ray and a 4K of Robert De Niro's A Bronx Tale. Now, Amazon has a listing for their own 4K of A Bronx Tale, but as far as I can tell, the only difference is going to be that it includes some postcards. But apparently, the cover art and packaging will be the exact same. Lionsgate will have the 4K edition of Contempt supposedly coming out this Tuesday. Now, this is an interesting case. It was just recently confirmed to be releasing this week, but Amazon's kind of being a little sketchy on if it is actually going to be shipped. Best Buy and other online retailers show it's still coming out this Tuesday, so I guess we'll have to wait and see if it's actually going to make it in people's hands this week. Terrifier 2 on 4K is getting a non-exclusive steelbook available this Tuesday. This Tuesday, Wallace and Gromit, the complete cracking collection, which features four movies, will be arriving on Blu-ray. If you remember, recently Lionsgate acquired the rights for distribution of both Kill Bill films and Jackie Brown. Well, they're starting out with Blu-ray re-releases, so Kill Bill Volume 1 and Kill Bill Volume 2 are getting non-exclusive steelbooks, and a Blu-ray edition of Jackie Brown will also be made available. I fully expect 4Ks to be announced in the coming year. 88 Films has the Blu-ray release of the action film Hard Boiled 2, The Last Blood. Tom Sizemore stars in the 2022 thriller Impuratus. And the 2022 action film The Channel is getting a Blu-ray release. A pair of films from WellGo USA are coming out on Tuesday, the action thriller Creepy Crawly, and the 2023 sci-fi adventure film Forgotten Experiment. The 2022 Western Sanctified will be getting a release, and the 1993 thriller The Dead Mother is coming out from Radiance Films, and the 1990 sci-fi drama The Last Island. Out on Blu-ray this Tuesday, the 2017 thriller The Nighttime Winds. A couple of titles getting a release on the TV Blu-ray front this Tuesday, Season 2 of Yellow Jackets and The Crown Season 5 are both getting a release. For you Westworld fans, the complete series is coming out on Blu-ray this Tuesday. And finally this week, a single release from the Criterion Collection. And with all Criterion titles, you can pick these up in store at your local Barnes & Noble. And of course, Criterion and Amazon.com are also there for your convenience. David Cronenberg's 1983 film Videodrome is coming out on 4K this week. As for my own pickups on Tuesday, I'm absolutely in for Snow White. If this 4K looks anything like what they did with Cinderella on 4K, I think we're all going to be very happy. And definitely going for the Megan 4K Steelbook. I love the artwork. I'm pretty excited to check that one out. I've also got orders in for the standard edition of Pumpkinhead on 4K, Rosemary's Baby, that's a no-brainer, and the Steelbook of Transformers Rise of the Beasts. 
A Bronx Tale on 4K is an absolute must. It has been many years since I've seen it. And once again, the 4K edition of Contempt. We'll see if it actually shows up from Amazon. I may have to order it if other online retailers are going to actually be shipping this week. And the 4K of Videodrome, that's a definite. I can't wait to watch that one again. Now it's your turn in the comments section below to let me know what you're planning to pick up on Blu-ray and 4K this Tuesday. And don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate link. If you're interested in any of these titles, it really does help out the channel when you do. And finally, a special thank you to my Patreons for your continued support. If you would like to support me through Patreon, I will leave a link in the description of this video. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.